friends. It's great to see you again. Follow me. Warm heart, chilly hands. Warm heart, chilly hands. Warm heart, chilly hands. Warm heart, chilly hands. Warm hands, warm. The farmer goes to plow. If you want to warm your hands, warm your hands now. Warm hands, warm. The farmer goes to plow. If you want to warm your hands, warm your hands now. Warm hands, warm. The farmer goes to plow. If you want to warm your hands, warm your hands now. You know what though, friends? I think it's time for a dance party. Let's go! so glad you're back because we have a lot of things to do today. We've been talking about the instrument families. Who remembers our four instrument families? Oh, that's one of them. Woodwind. And another? Yes, string. Two more. Brass. And what's our last one? Percussion. Those four families make up the instruments in our orchestra. And today, we're gonna to listen to some of them and see if you can guess what instrument you hear. Last time you shared some, with me some facts about different instruments as we discovered those four families and the instruments inside of them. We also talked about the instruments that we heard from our story, Peter and the Wolf. Today, the Dallas Symphony Orchestra has given us some beautiful sounds to listen to, and you'll be able to use the link to listen to them again later. Let's see if you know this instrument. Mm -hmm. When I play an instrument for you, just tell me if you know the name of it and what that instrument is. <laughs> was that? If you said the violin, you're right. Great job. I wonder if we can listen to another instrument. <laughs> what about this one, friends? What instrument does this sound like? Talk about the families. What instrument is the violin in? Wait, I said what instrument? What family is the violin in? You're right, the string family. How about the flute? Yeah, the woodwind family. Nice job, friends. Let's listen to a few more instruments. What instrument is this and what family is it in? was a trumpet, and it's in the brass family. How about this instrument? You've heard that from our class before, haven't you? It's the glockenspiel, and it's in the percussion family. Let's listen to a few more. Maybe you know these as well. Hmm, maybe a little bit 
trickier. Think about the other instruments in our string family. Oh, if you said cello, you're right. The instruments in our string family are violin, viola, cello, and double bass. The double bass is the lowest. It's even lower than that. The cello is pretty low, as you notice, but it also can play some notes that are a little bit higher. And that's why that sound was the cello. There's actually one more string instrument. See if you know this instrument. Yeah, the harp. The harp is a beautiful string instrument. Let's head to another family. I wonder if you know the name of this instrument. If you said bassoon, nice going. What family is the bassoon in? Yeah. It's in the woodwind family. Let's listen to a few more instruments in the woodwind family and see if you recognize them. Yeah, that instrument's the oboe. The oboe and bassoon are double reed instruments, which means they have to use two reeds, but the woodwind player pushes air between to make the sound. There's also some other woodwind instruments that can that sound similar but only have one reed. What instrument is this? Nice job again. That's the clarinet. Maybe you noticed that the oboe sound sounded a little bit like our duck from Peter and the Wolf, and the clarinet sounded like, yeah, the cat. That's another good way to see if you can remember the difference between the two. What about this instrument? I wonder if you know this one. It's the tuba. The tuba has a nice big sound. And it's in the brass family with our trumpet. What about this instrument? It's also in the brass family. Do you know its name? <laughs> yeah, friends. Oops, couldn't get, couldn't get my screen to work. That's the trombone. There's another instrument in our brass family, other than the trombone, the tuba, and the trumpet. What's this one? Did you notice that melody was pretty familiar? I uh, sure did. You knew it was from uh, the movie Star Wars. That's pretty cool. What instrument was it? Does it sound like the wolf to you? Yeah, because it's the French horn. Let's check out our percussion family now. We've listened to the glockenspiel already, but I bet you know a few other instruments too. What about this? <laughs> yeah, that's the cymbals. Sure is. Let's listen to a few more. What about this instrument? In fact, we have this one in class. It's the wood block. Yeah, good going, friends. Maybe one more. sounds a little bit like the hunters from Peter and the Wolf. That's because it is. It's the timpani. 
and the timpani are big drums that can make different pitches and sounds. And they're in the percussion family. Wow, What's, those are some really neat instruments that we just got to hear. And now I need your help. What if you could help categorize or sort all of these instruments into their correct family? I'm hoping you can help me with that. And let's see if you can find all the instruments that belong in the woodwind family, all the instruments that belong in the string family, and the brass family, and the percussion family. I can't wait to see how you do. Thanks again for joining us, second grade. I hope now we know a little bit more about our instrument families and how we can use our ears to identify them. See you next time.